crying yeah. a little bit <laughs> over here because of our next guest. It's not only a two-time Academy Award nominee who's starring in the new movie, Colette, but she's also from one of our favorite rom-coms ever, Love Actually. Yes, I so love So we movie. thought we'd bring her out in true Love Actually style. Okay, play. Thank you very much. Oh, thank you. How are you doing? I, I'm, I'm so pleased that you watched that film to get pumped. I'm like, I, I, that's, I, did, I that never true? thought, is Nothing that says love actually, nothing says getting pumped for a football game to hit big men like love actually. It's great. <laughs> yes, I watch it. It warms my heart. It is, it is truly, it's, it's one of my favorite movies. And I he said it, joking. and everyone so thought nice. I was, I was like, you're lying. I'm like, we no. thought it was a line. No, I thought, well, yeah. I mean, Doesn't yes, it sound a yeah, little bit like a line? It does sound like a little bit like a line, but I'm so pleased. It is not. I, I have a heart. Okay. And, <laughs> but but I wonder, do you watch it when it comes on? Sure, you know, I, I only saw it once when it first came out. So what, how long ago was that? 15 years ago? So I was obviously very, very young. I was 10 or something. <laughs> um, yeah, no, I've only seen it once. One time? Yeah. I feel like you're robbing yourself by not yes. having seen this. Yeah, d am I? Okay, yes, bit. okay. You should yeah. tune back in because... I, uh, yeah, I'll try. I will. I don't I, I don't watch any of my... I mean, like, I watch it all once, and I'm like, okay, cool. Okay. You can fast-forward your scenes, although Actually, that, yeah, I'm hardly that one's in it. the best. But you, but you kind of did it, and you move on, I yeah. guess, right? Yeah, yeah, kind of. And then it just feels a bit weird to sit down and watch your own thing. Well, yeah. But I'm not in it very much, so actually, I'll watch the rest of it, and then I'll, I'll really enjoy it. <laughs> in the weirdness, you started acting really young, and I think we have a photo from one of your first on-screen roles. Oh, look! Oh, you're the little oh, one I'm on the far one. left, I'm right? The really little one, right there. Now, yeah. is it true you <laughs> asked for an agent when you were only three years old? I did. <laughs> You know, How did you know? I don't know, because I have a three-year-old, and she doesn't know. So, I, I mean, I don't know. I, I think my, my mum was a writer and my dad was an actor, so I think there were agents ringing the house, and I was just like, if you've got one, why don't I have one? <laughs> um, so I had to wait a really long time. I got one when I was six. <laughs> oh, but, and, and, you know, at six, I'm like, can I get a bike? You know, yeah. you got an agent. No, I got an agent, yeah. And your daughter's three, Yeah. she has an ass, so she doesn't know. No, like she wants said. to be a dentist. She wants Aww. to be a... Which I'm really happy about. I'm like, you know, that's a good job. That's it's a good, great steady, job. steady, Everyone's great job. You know yeah. that's, that's a great job, <laughs> yeah. and, and I could use her. Yes. <laughs> um, <laughs> <That's a good laughs> well, you know, but something I'm pretty sure, I don't know, you're playing the sugar plum fairy in the nutcracker in the four rounds. Yeah, I am. Yeah. Look at that. Has your daughter seen you in a costume yet? Yeah, she came to set quite a lot. And uh, I, what you can't see from this picture is that m the dress that I'm wearing, it's a very large dress. And it was sort of a bit like a bell. So she just kept lifting up and going underneath and going, Mommy, you're wearing a tent. You're a tent. <laughs> so, yeah, she was very excited. But what was really weird was that I thought, I was quite careful when I brought her to set because I thought it's quite an extreme. It's a very big pink wig. So I thought, you know, maybe she'll get a bit freaked out. And she just didn't even bat an eyelid. She was like, oh, hello, hello, Mommy. I don't normally look like this. What's going on? Does she grasp when you're on a screen when she sees you? No, she actually, you know what, um, Pirates of the Caribbean was on over Christmas, and I thought, oh, it was, it was like on TV, and I thought, I'll leave it on and just see how she reacts, and it was a bit where I sort of fell off something into the water, and again, she said, Mommy, you, you've fallen in the water. I said, yes, I have. She said, I rescue you. Oh! And then just walked off, and that was it. I tell you right now, you have a, a little actress on your hands. I, I hope mean, not. that's really a sweetheart. Or a dentist. But she's a, a, dentist. But she's a dentist. sweetheart. Of a, a, she, sounds, she sounds like a sweetheart. She's great. But you've worn a lot of corsets, a lot of wigs, <laughs> Atonement, Pride and Prejudice, The yeah. Duchess, and now Colette. Yep. And tell us about this film. I, it's yeah. such a fascinating story. It's a fascinating story. It's, uh, it's a true story um, about uh, Colette, who is one of the most famous sort of novelists, French novelists of all time. <laughs> Um, she was married to a man called Willie, who took credit for her first four novels. So it's the story of how she sort of, that relationship, how she finds her own voice. It's very empowering. It's a very feminist piece, um, which I always like. So, yeah, it's, it's yeah, she's a powerful... We have the female cooking homecoming queen. We've got yeah. here night nice Colette. We've got it all. We have a clip, though. Yeah, and, yeah and, we, and we have a clip as well. So Great. here we go. Here's Kira Knightley and Colette. Pleasure to meet you. Pauline at school is heading for her third printing. 
excellent. I believe Willie based Claudine in part on your school days. Yes, I think I had a little something to contribute. Well, I'm very glad your experiences have borne such wonderful fruit. Very nice to meet you, Madame. You know, if I was still playing football, I'd watch this to get pumped up. <laughs> Great. And you know, I gotta say, I actually love every time I see you. Oh, thank you. Yeah. Thank and we, you. you need to watch Love, actually. I will. Okay, I will. I'll, I'll go But that. everybody at home, make sure you get out this Friday. It hits fr September 21st to see Colette. That's what you better do. Well, hey there, GMA fans. Robin Roberts here. Thanks for checking out our YouTube channel. Lots of great stuff here. So go on, click the subscribe button right over, right over here to get more of awesome videos and content from GMA every day, anytime. We thank you for watching. And we'll see you in the morning on GMA.